Right then, my friends, we're back inside the building. Anna Correa joins me this morning. How are you doing, my darling? Yes, fantastic. That's what we like to hear. That's what we like to hear. So, um, I believe you've brought some uh, some fun and games with you. Yes. To, to get involved with this morning. A lovely quiz. A lovely quiz. So that's what we're going. We're straight into a quiz after five months of, of no no, of, of, no, of no radio stuff. And quizzes left, right, and centre. We're now going into a quiz. This isn't a Zoom quiz. Yeah, this I, I won't lie. This isn't your average video call quiz. This okay. is a radio quiz. That's what, that's what I'm talking about. I'm, I'm not a fan of Zoom quizzes. That's what I <laughs> no. discovered over the lockdown thing. I'm not <laughs> a fan of Zoom quizzes. It's just pandemonium. <laughs> Were you the one that just came up with the emoji? And no, no, we, we, did, um, we brought. We did Cards Against Humanity. We bought a card. Uh, we bought okay. a Cards Against Humanity server and just roasted each other oh. for, the, for, for the first sort of like two <laughs> or three weeks. That was the best thing that we did. Light-hearted fun. That's yeah. good. Just Come on. Keep... Come on, that's what we're talking about. But this is a lot better than your average, your average quiz. Okay, Whereas cool. the general knowledge, we're going to go for first. Cool. Okay. So uh, I actually got the touchpad ready to go. You've got the touchpad. Right, yeah. Okay. Cool. 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 All right. Are you ready? I am. Yes. You, you, you know what I'm doing? Ready. I'm that ready that I'm hovering over correct rather. Than correct. Oh, that is very arrogant behaviour. But let's see. What was the set? No, I'm not even going to say. It. Okay, which country has the longest coastline in the world? Oh, I know this. Well, I'm sure you do. But... Is it New Zealand? Oh no, it's not. <coughs> Play it. Play it. If you're going to hover, yeah, there we go. There we go. It's Canada. Ah! Yes. I'm going to pretend like I knew that, yeah. and that's why. Do you know why? Yes. I had that exact question in a lockdown quiz, and that's why I'm annoyed. Did you? Yeah. I, I had Clearly, no I wasn't idea. paying attention, or it didn't retain any information. I was no. that bored of hearing everyone shout UK, over each other for probably. about 20 minutes. I would have said, like, the Thames or something. No, the Thames, that's a river. Wait. <laughs> Longest coastline. <laughs> Brighton or something. Um, let's go. Next one, next one. In on. which year was the popular video game Fortnite first released? You should know this. I otherwise. should, because I play it. Oh, you know what? I'm going to go 2017. Oh, brilliant. Go. He's got it. Well there done. We very, on. very proud of you. Right, next one. Which city hosted the Olympics in 2000? Uh, I don't know this. It's not Athens. It's not London. It's not China. Is it German? Is it a city in Germany? No. Uh, well, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm myself the wrong end. I'm, I'm so I'm a, sorry. I'm a wrong end. What was it? Sydney. Oh. It was Sydney. I, I know. I Die Another Day the other day, and it literally mentioned Sydney 2000 in that film. Does it? It's dreadful. And that came out in 2001, so... Oh, funnily enough, the next question is actually, name the longest river in the UK. I'm, I'm assuming it's the Thames. <laughs> no, it's actually not. It's uh, the Ada. River Seven. The Seven. Oh. River Seven. Where is the River it's Seven? It's useless at geography on this country. Yeah, I don't, I don't know where any of this is. River Seven, where is that? Um, it's next to the River Six. <laughs> is that actually true because I don't know I'm so gullible that I'll literally be like there must be seven rivers in the UK then no it's uh, right. I've just made it up for a giggle right okay so okay. that's next one let's go Come so on, we're going go. on to film questions now okay, you cool. did alright there not great but alright so first one which film was the first to be recognised as part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe Iron Man 1 come on yes I, I, right I, I had ready. to double check that then I was like yeah. uh, come on wonderful which colour pill does Neo swallow in the Matrix does he Where take You see I, Matrix is my favourite film And I always get this question wrong How? I got How this, can it be this, your this, this is a lockdown then? quiz Because I've had these questions You're a fake Matrix fan um, then that oh, like, only two no, You see I'm influenced by a, 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 there's, a, there's a battle where someone does it And I think he gets it wrong in the battle So I'm going to go You've got 50-50 really don't you? Red pill mm, That's right There we go Well done I'm so proud of you I would be proud of me as well you have, you said, have you seen the Matrix? No, I haven't. Oh, come on. I'm literally here just sending all my sats, but I haven't, oh, I haven't so seen it. The, one of the I'm best sorry. films of all time. Yeah, I've heard it is good. Is that with Keanu Reeves where he does that yeah, little backflip but thing? I, it's, it, there's so much nuance in it. I didn't watch it till I was 23. Oh, right, okay. So if you watch it when you're younger, you kind of get taken in by all like the floatiness and everything. But yeah. the concept behind it, if you watch it for the first you time at 23... You I'm going to give it a watch this week and I'll come back. You're going to come back and, and I'm going to tell come back. you. See what you're going to do. You're going to come back and feel the walls and go, I don't know if it's real or not. That's what's going to happen. Oh, yeah, because he thinks he's like, is it a game or something he thinks he's I'm in? I'm not going to tell you what happens. That's fine. I don't want to get involved because otherwise I won't leave. Right, cool. Next one. Which husband's wife... Wait. Hmm. I can't read. Which husband-wife duo starred in 2018's horror film A Quiet Place? I have no idea. No idea. So, 
Go the ah, ah. Oh, that's good. Emily Blunt and John Krasinski. Okay, cool. Don't know who they are. So you haven't seen it? No, don't even know who they well, are. Well, that's your homework for the week then. Okay, uh, okay. To watch enough. The Quiet Place. Fair enough. Very well done. <laughs> I'm not mad at it. <laughs> well, so, which three films make up what is known as the Three Flavours Cornetto Trilogy? Um, It is... Oh, I'm gonna, if I get this wrong, I'm going to be so upset with myself. Sounds delicious, so whatever it, it is. So, it is Shaun of the Dead, Hot yes. Fuzz... And uh, World's End. Oh, you've aced it. Well done. Come on. Shaun of the no Dead. Idea what that was. This is the thing. Shaun of the Dead is a better film than Hot Fuzz, but Hot Fuzz is the best comedy film this country's ever produced. Are they? That's the one with the Sean Pegg and stuff. Where's Sean Pegg? Sean Pegg. Do you mean Sean do you mean Penn? I always do this. I come on the radio Simon, and, I'm, Simon Pegg and, and I Nick embarrass Frost. myself. Simon yes. Pegg and Nick Frost. Sean Penn? He's the one from Lord of the Rings, isn't he? Sean Bean! <laughs> Come on! <gasps> right, okay, cool. We've got about we've got about a minute left. Right, okay, so okay. how many films have Kate Winslet and Leonardo DiCaprio starred in together? Three. Random guess. Mm, no. Well, two. Two. Fair Titanic enough. and Revenant. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, do we have time the for Revenant, more? The Revenant. Is no, it the Revenant. The Revenant. Revol- the Revol- I can't say it. The <laughs> Revolutionary Road. There we go. Revolutionary Road. Okay, fair enough. So. We've got time for one more. So this is a science quiz. Have you been keeping score? Yes. Okay, how many have I got? You haven't been keeping score, have you? <laughs> you want me to tell you the answers you want me to count it's too much for okay, me okay. for my first rodeo okay <laughs> I can't keep up right last question how many eggs does the average chicken lay per year <laughs> is it like 6,000 or something insane like that <laughs> no it's not actually what do you want to have another guess uh, 4,000 no 260 I don't know what they're doing on the other 100 odd days not on being my farm. lazy <laughs> not on my farm do chickens get weekends off is it <laughs> What kind of farm is this? God. Uh, right then, how many did I get? I think I got six. I think you got, yeah, so went to, I'm going to say you got about eight. I got about eight. Out I, of I, like ten. You know what? I'm happy with that. I'm going to give you eight out of ten. So I definitely got at least four wrong, so I'm going to take the extended. What I'm going to do, I'm going to listen to it back, and then next week, next I'll week, give you your score. I'm going to get my score next week. It'll be week. like getting your GCSEs. Ugh. So you're going to have to wait like a week and what, I'll come what back. Point, what a pointless day that was. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to carry on. This next one, Sean Dean, Gemma Fox and Bomber B. We're going UKG on this one. Sounds of Boxers 2020. Following that, we're getting into some NSG and some Brucey and Charlie P. Don't go anywhere. It's breakfast. Bye.